The book of Judges, you can see it as a story of people constantly failing God. You can see it as a story of humankind going on a downward trajectory. You can see it as a completely disturbing portrait of even our modern day messed up world where people in their own arrogant freedom will do whatever it is that they feel like is the right thing for them to do and yet cumulatively it seems like everything is just going downhill. You can look at judges and get so frustrated with all of the human frailties and all of the human failures but the one thing you can never get get frustrated at is the fact that God inexplicably keeps loving them, inexplicably keeps giving them more grace. And after 400 years of the loser judge after loser judge after loser judge and the people of Israel consistently wandering away from God, God will eventually bring them a king who's a man after his own heart. And he'll make that king a promise that in the future, another king will come, an heir of this king's throne, who will be the forever king. And through the journey of an Israelite nation that thinks they should own the land when they don't really own the land, and the journey of an Israelite nation that never seems to pay attention to what God actually wants at the time he wants it, and a Jewish nation who is oppressed again by some other foreign power will come face to face with a judge named Jesus. A judge named Jesus who will say things they can't accept. And they will kill him. And he will rise again, proving for all time that he is the hero we all need. Thanks for listening to this message from Lafayette Community Church. We are all about helping you live the life you were made to live. God made you. God loves you. And his plans for you are perfect. So if you are anywhere near Lafayette, Indiana, join us this weekend at one of our worship gatherings. And wherever you are, check us out online at lafayettecommunitychurch.com.